My name is Susan Detroit and I am a visual artist and I'm taking a photo outside because uh, I use nature and in a lot of my art making. This video is going to show more of what I do, hard copy and NFTs. My first collection is Las Flores Divinas, rose art with a story integrating the history of roses and our relationship with these magnificent flowers. Moving roses will be part of the collection soon. My Portrait of a Woman series uses my aging female face and natural elements. This art will become still and moving NFTs while continuing hard copy reproductions. I welcome you to my expansive lifetime of making art. My artwork is self and earth loving created with iPhone and iPad devices and apps drawing from and integrating the natural world. Thank you, Susan Detroit artist was relating to all the words that you were using that seemed apropos of, of what I, I wanted to show a little bit of my past work because it so deeply influences the layered type of work I do now. In the 90s, I was creating pieces with dragonfly and cactus theme using historic uh, processes, which you can see are deeply layered, cyanotype, and then liquid transfers. Another piece that had uh, Van Dyke brown and then layered with uh, markings. This piece here is representative when I started using uh, layers that are created with matte medium. And this is another piece that uses that similar work. It's a close up of a transfer piece. Short video that shows the type of transfer I was creating that I put on my pieces creating a layer that goes on a canvas. In the 2000s, I started mixing digital and layering with photographic work that I was using. I used uh, flowers that were actually adhered to a piece. And, and I've also done a transfer and then used that to create a layer with my own face in a digital way. And then I became more, I guess I'd say, assertive, aggressive about my layering, using the natural world in my own face, and started a series called Portrait of a Woman that I've been doing in six years, layers my own face with leaves. And so there's a mini section uh, of that project. More current piece that I did that I took my own face and then layered it with an image that I created from like a forest photograph, uh, put it through iColorama, and actually it's now an NFT and it moves and it has uh, butterflies in it. I'm also starting to work with AI using my own face and layering it with roses. This is an experiment. And then the last thing that that I'm doing is I'm creating pieces I call a planetary sisters. And this is actually a combination of several layers of app work that I began with an AI, this AI image that I generated with Wombo. And then I used my own face and then I layered my face into this AI face and I created her. I have a number of these that I'm working on. I, I did enter this one into a, a mobile photography and it got a, an honorable mention. I feel like I could say that ditto to Roz, like layer is me. <laughs> I use layers all the time. I, I've been using layers for since the 90s to produce work and I, I adore using layers and I always feel excited when I have the opportunity to talk about layers. 